Hi friends, this is Chris with Josephine's Design. I am back with the second part of my Scrapbooking for Less um, order. It um, came in before all of this broke out and of course everything was either on sale, had a coupon, or was literally in their clearance, which probably 90% was their clearance. So um, I will keep going here and um, I have debated whether or not to do, to share these things and decided that a lot of people on here on YouTube are sharing things as an encouragement and as somebody who hasn't been off her property in almost a month um, and the only thing I've been ordering is flour and eggs and cleaners and vinegar and whatever else I could get that would help us take care of our property, take care of our family, um, take care of our, our critters. Um, that's it. That's it. So. Um, I hope you don't mind um, I, if I share this. A lot of people said, yes, please share. So I'm going to do that. And again, I am not trying to be insensitive at all because um, we've been sick. We have not been as sick as some, and we are so thankful for that. We thank God every day that, um, you know, though it was not fun and it was horrible, um, we know that we are blessed right now. And so... Anyways, I just want to share, and a lot of this had been pre-ordered for the spring and summer camps, and then fall as well. So we are going to have the Bible camp, Bible drawing camps. Um, the spring may be in early summer, <laughs> and then the summer may, may be in late summer. So, um, but that's okay. Um, unless everybody writes me and says, just have one and combine it, and I will gladly do that too. So, um, all right, well, let's get going here. So, the first thing I see is another stack of individual papers. So, what I did is I went through and found all of the journaling cards for myself, for the camps, things like that. Um, myself for my own Bible journaling, or my journals, or my planners, or my etc, etc, etc. I do save the bags, and especially now. Um, they're great for organizing. And, yeah. So, alright. I'm not going to go through this page, page by page, but I am going to kind of give you a, a bit of a flip. So how's that? I'm going to try. My left hand doesn't always work as well. So there were some series like this I knew I would use for fall, um, this fall Bible journaling camp, and I thought this would be beautiful. And um, yeah, look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? I know. That's like a mixed media page. <laughs> I love this. So I, I hope you can kind of see this before I turn it. But I thought these were all beautiful. I have projects in mind and or, you know. Oh, that's so cute. This is spring. I love that. I'm going to pull that out. And the other side was that. So I'm going to pull that out so I can work on that this weekend. Because this weekend, oh, I love that. The Vintage Women. Um, this weekend is, pa it's Passover started Wednesday night. And um, let's see. And then we have, Resur we have a Good Friday this, fr uh, this Friday. Today is Thursday, which that is tomorrow, and then we have, um, what am I trying to say? Then we have Easter, or Resurrection Day, which is Sunday. So, I want to do some things for my family. I love that. That's going to go. So, I hope you don't mind me shopping while we're looking. <laughs> I'm going to shop my stash while we're looking. Okay. <laughs> Pulling those things out. So, I love that. Oh, I love it. Oh, and this is all Easter, too. Fun. It's called Harmony. And um, many of you know that um, the Reset Girl has done a Harmony camp, and I didn't get to go to it. But when I saw this paper, I just thought, ooh, I love that. And so I'm going to make my own Harmony camp, and I'm good with that because I've got all my Sojo Academy goodies that I'll use, all my Bible studies, and I'm going to make my own. So there we go. If you want me to, I can come back and share that project. If you don't, that's okay. Um, I love this. I love this. It's upside down, but I love it. Um, this is by, it's called Trans Transatlantic Tra Travel. Transatlantic Travel by Cartabella. Sorry, guys. I've been making a few videos, and I'm getting kind of, oh, forward with faith. And I do have those in the other order, so I'm going to pull those out. Because that will go with that kit over there. And then I've got these. These are all the Grandma Granny, you know. I am a Mimi. <laughs> I'm being that specific. <laughs> I don't want to be called Granny. 
<laughs> my gra I had a grandmother that we called Granny, and I did not name her that. My my cousins did. So um, I was the oldest in our. And then of course I have stuff for the baby. Sorry, it's upside down. But if I move this at any arm right now, my left hand is going to scream. So I got all this for my grandbaby, who I adore. And I have pictures that are loaded, ready to go. And my cam my phone crashed. I lost tons of pictures, but. If I have to, I'm going to take my husband's and get them forwarded to me. So this is for next winter. I love this. Um, I love anything rustic. Oh, that's fall. No wonder. And then, um, I think that's fall. Yeah, I think that's fall. And then more winter. And then summer. This looks like summer. Yeah, I love that. And then this is Christmas. I have this series, so whenever I find it, and it's something that I can use that's consumable, like paper, I always pick up at least one or two. Oh, and this is um, this is kind of a Valentine's, but you can use it anytime. And I love this. I love the pastel. So here's more of that Valentine. And then just fun tags that I love. Those are so cute. Um, I just was cutting out some tags. I got a calendar. I thought I shared with you guys from Christy, um, and it's Create with Christy, I think. And anyways, um, she's here in Texas, and I she sent me the calendar. It was in something I ordered from her, and so I was cutting apart the calendar because it was all of her printables are for each month. And I just sat there and started cutting out tags and all kinds of stuff that so I could use in Bible journaling. So, and she's a Christian; she does neat stuff. Um, I will try to remember and link that below. Um, and this, of course, is scrappingforless.com. So I love this. Summer loving. Pop into fun. Amazing. I'm really hoping by summer we are all good to go. Right, guys? We are going to have a lot to be thankful for this year. For those that have gotten through everything. More. I love the Valentine I'm grateful for. I love that. Okay. Mmm. I get three of those. That's funny. I don't know why I did that. Um, more Thanksgiving. Oh, I love that. That's just beautiful home. Thanksgiving and home. So, I am going to use these two and pull these out too. Because that fits her right now, right? <laughs> oh, goodness. Okay, this is Believe by the Bunny. That's why I have these. Okay. I remembered I, I had pick certain things for, you know, that were on sale that I thought, oh, I can use them with. Because they didn't have, like, if you were buying the, the pages or the cardstock individually, you didn't necessarily have the full set. So if they matched in any way, then I bought them. And I thought those will work with some of my other Christian kits that I have. So, and that is for fall. So, love it, love it, love it. You know what I'll be doing? I'll be, orga I'll be cutting everything out and organizing everything by season. Okay, and then I picked up that for fall, and I thought it was gorgeous. It is by Cartabella, and it is The Fall Break by Stephen Duncan. So, and I, I specifically picked this one because I love the country church. I don't know about y'all, but I love to go and see country churches. They're so beautiful, old churches. So, so pretty. I love all that. So that'll be fun for fall. And then I have the Country Kitchen, which I'm doing a recipe um, fun thing. And so I'm going to put this to the side. I'm doing it with my Happy um, Happy Planner recipe book. And I've got another one that I might be getting to have sent here. And, yeah, I love this. Everything's vintage, and my husband raises chickens, and we don't do pigs. We don't do pigs. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> um... Well, number one, we don't eat chickens, we eat the eggs, and then, um, and we share the eggs. And for milk, we use some milk, like right now we're breaking down and getting some milk so that we can make um, yogurt ourselves. I'm not a plant-based yogurt fan, so that's why we're doing that. And then, um, when I was in high school, I was forced to get in a pig pen to catch a sow who was not happy to be caught, <laughs> She was mean and I had a it was I was in FFA and I was dressed to go <laughs> in my little blue and white loafers and white sweater to go to a golf thing <laughs> afterwards. I was not your typical FFA girl and so oh, that particular FFA teacher was horrible. I'm not even gonna be nice about it. He was horrible 
and it was more for his his uh, amusement that I ran around. <laughs> so, okay, so I'm just gonna dump this out, guys. All right, now I can put that back up there because we are saving everything um, that can be reused and repurposed. So let's just get our stack together and then let's go through it. So Ford with Faith, which is that Lori Whitlock series, and I have the kit and I have this. So I love this. I think it is going to be beautiful and we're okay on time. So I'm going to bust it open with you guys. And let's take a look. Um, yeah, no, I, I, we quit eating pork way long before we quit eating meat. And I mean like 30 years ago. Um, we'd have an occasional piece of bacon. And yeah, we don't miss it. I think my youngest daughter misses bacon. I'll be honest. But um, the rest of us had already kind of stopped eating pork. Oh, I love these. Oh my goodness. Lori Whitlock. I would love to meet her someday. She's such a talented artist. I love have faith and pray, which is what we're doing right now, guys. Let the light of Jesus shine through you. It's what I keep saying. Oh, I love this. And I love the birdies and the, oh, I just love it. Don't you? I love, look at all the churches. Sorry, I'm not doing a good job, guys. I'm sorry. My hands are sore. It's starting to rain, you know. I'm just, oh, I'm just old today. <laughs> felt pretty old lately. So here is John 3.16. Here is Jeremiah 31.3. I have loved you with an everlasting love that is from God and to God. Do not let anyone think less of you because you are young. Be an example to the believers in what you say, in the way you live, in your love, in your faith, and your purity. And that's from 1 Timothy 4.12, which at that time, Timothy was thinking he couldn't talk to people about Jesus because he was too young. And Paul said, don't let that stop you. So, whether you're young or old, educated or not, your walk is your walk. You share it. You share. Oh, I love that. Oh, I'm going to make my daughter, for her birthday, a card with that, I think. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Amen. Amen. Um, bless your heart. <laughs> oh, that's so pretty. Okay, Lori Woodlock did it again. She is amazing. And like I said, I would love to meet her. She's so talented. And every time I pick up a Lori Whitlock design I like save it because I think there's it's not gonna happen again and you know it is but it's just that I just love it so I'm starting to break out and use all this um, I got this for my Bible journaling and my um, uh, memory decks and all that so you can see you can use this in your journals your Bible journal you can use it to make cards on and on and on so I think that's cute Interestingly for us, we've not had any birthdays during all this. So, anyways, okay, this goes with, I bought this, and this is the frames and tags, and it is down on the farm. That's it. Oh, no, I didn't buy this kit, did I? Maybe I did or didn't. I can't, I don't, I can't remember. I probably bought some of the pages. So, I love all that, because that's where we live. <laughs> and here, oh, you know I had to get this, because it was a llama and alpaca. Alpaca bag and travel with you. So I love all that. So it's travel. And this again is Cartabella and it is the pack your bags kit. Okay. This one is the other pack your bags kit and it has all the frames and tags. I love frames and I love tags. So you can see all that it comes with. I just love those. Okay. I did get these for our camp and for my daughter. There's 40 pieces. I'd hoped to use our spring I already had a theme that kind of laid on my heart. So, anyways, if you guys still want me to do the spring camp just later, let me know. But if not, I'll use these for my youngest. It is not a problem. Or next year. Okay, so this is the American Crafts Heidi Swap. Yeah, this is a 64 kit. It was a 64 piece kit. It was a phenomenal deal. And there's acetate. It's gorgeous. You can just see some of that. Um, but here's the actual. Let me get the light in my eyes. So hopefully it's not in yours. So, yeah, and there's some gold foiling. So beautiful. Heidi Swap is so talented. Okay, pebbles. I think those are so sweet. And more. And one more. Because I always get enough for everybody. <laughs> okay. And then this was a die cut. That was just everything. Happy Spring, Blossom, 
chickadee, daydreaming, happy spring, hippity hop, natural beauty, flowers, spring, dance in the rain, springtime, fly kite, all those. So, and then here is an Echo Park, which I love Echo Park. This is um, obviously for spring and Easter. So I'm going to put that right up there and I will use that this weekend. And I have, hold on, another Echo Park. So here is the, it's the same, it's Spring Fling. What was this one? Sorry. Easter Wishes. This is Easter Wishes and this is Spring Fling. So all those good things. Spring, oh, all that. So beautiful. Celebrate today. Spring has sprung and sunny days have begun. You are amazing. The best spring. Love that. Okay. Then I have a Echo Park. I love crafting, which I got some. I got the stamps in an earlier purchase, so I'm super excited to play with that. That will go straight over there. And then this is Follows in the Air. So I was picking up things that were on clearance. Uh, their sales are fantastic. I'm serious. It's like going to Tuesday morning online, and you don't have to stand on your feet, okay, or stand in line to check out. So, uh, fall is in the air, fall, thankful and blessed, family, I just loved all this, blessed, 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 so, love that. Um, these go with one of the kits I purchased, that I purchased some of the pages, I believe this is, I think I want to think this is Harmony, but this is the Bow Bunny Layered Chipboard, and I think it's gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. I'm trying to see, looks like the Harmony, but I may be wrong. Okay, I'm excited. Yay! It's a llama day. So, very sweet. Can you imagine the day when we are not dealing with this terrible illness? And it's going to feel just like that. Yay. You know, yay, yay, hooray, yay. And that's how we should hooray for the for cake, hooray for all of the people, the first responders, the, the doctors, the nurses, the scientists, the grocery people, the delivery people, hooray, hooray, hooray. I can't wait till we're not sick anymore and I can start giving things to all the people that did something for us while we were sick. Um, making things, thank yous, all of that. Uh, forward with faith. So that's that kit that I have the whole kit on or the pages on so I'm excited to play with this. Love that. Of course I'll use that in my Bible journaling, etc. Okay, more down on the farm. You know, because this is just the Fun ephemera. I love that barn. And it says, always kiss your farmer goodnight. That's right. Farm living is the life for me. <laughs> I'm not going to sing. I'm sorry. <laughs> Green Acres. Okay, Ford with Faith. Oh, I love this. Look at all that faith. Love is spoken here. Unless you're panicking and they're making a delivery. <laughs> that happened yesterday. At the last minute, my daughter didn't come out to help. I can't lift the boxes yet. I'm just, I just can't. And my husband decided to blow the driveway by the gate where I had just wiped out all the boxes and gotten them down to the gate. <coughs> and they were supposed to put the groceries in there. And I was like, no, no, you can't do that. And he's like, just put the boxes up and put them back. Literally, he blew it. And I, the man drove up. And I went and put the boxes down. That, I was just, I'm not that kind of, I like to have them sitting there for like 10 minutes and have it all ready and, you know, anyways. But, oh, I had to pray about that afterwards because I was like, no, no, we can't do this right now. <laughs> and then we come back and there's an there are amp house everywhere right now. And anyways, we're walking back on the pathway to the house and there's a big amp pile and I looked at my daughter and I said, well, how come when he blew, it didn't blow that amp pile away? <laughs> and she said, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, come on. Don't you wonder those things? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm kind of silly. I'm at the last of my videos. You can tell <clears throat> my voice is... Okay, catch my breath. I will be fine. I love winter. Again, Lori Whitlock by Echo Park. Love her. And I'm excited to go back and use some of this in my um, journaling that I still have to finish up from winter and then also my um, my scrapbooking. So I don't have all my pictures printed. I was trying to print them every week as much as I could. I don't know why I've never done that but um, so I have I have plenty I can work on but I wanted that. And then I got this for summer and this is 
um, Let's Party by Echo Park. So, just for, you know, like it goes with some of the other stuff we have. All right, I did get some stencils. I don't, I hardly ever get stencils. I know. Um, I do some, but not a lot. So, first off, I saw that. Little bitty tiny baby feet. So you know who that's for, my granddaughter. Put that one up here, and then the crosses. It can be now. It's forward with faith. I could use this at Christmas when I'm using all that other gorgeous Christian goodies. Um, that's just because I love the Southwest and all of that, and I thought it was neat. And we camped a lot with our kids, and just this one is from Adventure Awaits by Echo Park. And then this one is my word for the year, joy, joy, joy. So you know why I have that one. So, ah, oh, we made it, guys. I'm going to go sit back for a minute and drink some water and um, catch my breath. But um, thanks so much for being here today. I'm so glad um, to be with you guys. And I again, I hope that this encourages you. It doesn't... Um, frustrate you. These were all bought on clearance with a coupon, with a sale, with their like 50 cent type things. Um, every, I highly, highly suggest, um, I love Tuesday morning and I love scrapbooking for less. It is the most affordable gig in town. So, all right guys, um, I don't even know how much I spent on all of this, but it was less than a hundred dollars for both videos combined. And um, and I think it was substantially less. I have to go back and look at the receipt. But amazing, so I got stickers, I got ephemera, I got stencils, I've got kits, I've got individual papers, I've got all of that. I mean, this has been a blessing and it'll be a long time before I'll be out doing anything like this again for a while. Um, I do have a couple of my Happy Planner boxes to open and a Target that I will video because I got to get that up this evening and then that's it. I'm, I'm not going to do the heavy planner for a couple of days and yeah, I mean, I, we are down to bare bones just like everybody else. So I'm sharing what we've already been blessed with. So, okay, my friends, um, send me information if you guys want to know how you want to do the spring and summer camps. Um, I am going to, I am praying about it. I've decided that yes, we need to do them. And we're just trying to decide now, and I'm seeking the Lord on this, whether it would be two very, you know, maybe shorter separates, which I'd already known God was telling me to, you know, to change the days per camp, and or do you want me to put them together? And we would still keep it in the same time frame. So we could combine spring and summer. And, or do you want to skip spring and just do summer? You guys just let me know. I am um, praying about it, and I'd love for your feedback as well. Okay, friends, most importantly, I pray your day is blessed, creative, and lovely. Sounds like that storm must have passed us by. My husband is now back to mowing. So, uh, yeah, hope that's not too noisy for you. Okay, my friends, I pray your day is blessed, creative, and lovely. Please be safe. If you didn't see the first video, go see part one. I'm going to put these up on the next two Tuesdays. And, yeah, okay, friends, I'll be talking to you soon. Love you guys. Bye-bye.